Always pay attention to the concentration. That's the key to every problem. The concentration here is 100 milligrams per 10 ml. Dr. Green writes an order for furosemide, 80 milligrams, IV twice a day. The pharmacy has 100 milligram per 10 ml vial in stock. How much must the nurse withdraw for the dose? Let's do this as a ratio proportion uh, problem first. We'll set up the ratio, 100 milligrams over 10 ml is equal to 80 milligrams over X ml. That's what we want to find out. How much milliliters do we have to withdraw from the vial? Then we cross multiply 80 milligrams times 10 ml divided by 100. And our answer is 8 ml. Let's now do this in as a dimensional analysis problem. 80 milligrams is what we want to find out how much milliliters to withdraw. So we do 80 milligrams over 1 times 10 ml over 100 milligrams. We want the, the milligrams to cross out with each other, so that's why we do 10 ml over 100 milligrams. So the milligrams will cross out with the milligrams, leaving you with just milliliters. And then we multiply 80 times 10 is 800. Over 1 times 100 is 100. So 80 divided by 100 is equal to 8 ml, because milliliters is the only unit left over after you cross out the milligrams and the milligrams. Thank you very much. If you have any questions, please send me an email. Thank you.